स्टेज फॉर मेकिंग बुक कवर फॉर मेकिंग ऑफ दिस बुक कवर दिस इज द फ्रंट साइड ऑफ दिस कवर बुक कवर एंड दिस इज द बैक साइड इट लुक्स लवली insert hook okay so now for this stitch first we need to chain 9 one 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 okay now to make a flower just make a circle of first five chains 1 2 3 4 and 5 with the help of slip stitch see again i'm showing you 1 2 3 4 and 5 just insert hook in the fifth chain and make a circle with slip stitch okay so now we have created circle to make further flower now chain 4 1 2 3 Four. Now just insert hook into this first chain and again use slip stitch. Okay. Now next we'll use. triple crochet so just wrap it wrap it thread for two times insert hook into the circle from the circle wrap it two times and insert hook from the circle and just complete triple crochet again repeat the same thing triple crochet 1 2 now to complete one petal of flower we have to used five times stitches so 1 2 3 and 4 one more is required so that will be downwards chain 4 and and just work single crochet from this circle single crochet okay again chain 4 1 2 3 and 4 now work triple crochet for four times from the same circle Two, three, four, and again one more triple crochet. Okay, now the half flower we have completed. Now again we are going to make one more flower. So for that, just chain nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. 
Now make a circle of first five chains. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. With the help of slip stitch, just insert hook in fifth chain and slip stitch. Now again. chain 4 2 3 and 4 now insert insert hook into the first chain of the second flower here or at the end of previous flower just insert hook here and work slip stitch now just turn this flower over here and work triple crochet from this second circle that we made chain 4 here 4 stitches are completed so this is the first petal of this second flower so just we'll complete this with 4 chains and with single crochet from the down circle ok now chain more chain 4 2 3 4 triple crochet four times from the same circle So now here we have completed two petals, two flowers with two petals. Again just go forward with the same process, chain 9, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Make a circle of first 5 chain, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, first 5 chains with the help of slip stitch. this is our third circle again chain 4 1 2 3 and 4 just insert hook from the first chain or at the end point of previous flower at this point and connect this two stitch with slip stitch okay now again work two times triple crochet from this circle one two again triple crochet now similarly from the previous petals now we'll complete this pat uh, first petal of this third flower with four chain stitch 
four four chain stitch and we'll finish this with single stitch from this circle again for the second petal of this flower chain four two three and four triple crochet again triple crochet again triple crochet now here we are going to add our end our first row so for that as in the previous pattern we have used triple crochet for the last stitch here but here we are going to end this pattern with four chain stitch three and four because further it is not connected from here with single crochet okay so half of the flower row we have completed now next we are going to make next row which will start from here and will complete this first flower okay so just hold your hook like this okay chain four one two three and four triple crochet again triple crochet again triple crochet now four times chain stitch two three and four and just finish it with single crochet now chain four triple crochet now this is the last petal of this flower again triple crochet again triple crochet one two three four one more stitch is required okay so so here we have completed our first flower so now now this petal of this flower is connected with the third petal of this flower so we'll directly use triple crochet and we'll connect the petal with this th circle so this way we can connect two flowers again triple crochet two times more triple crochet okay. now triple crochet for four times now for the fifth we are going to use four times single crochet stitch and just complete this petal with single crochet now again now for the next petal chain four one two three and four double triple crochet four four times one two three and four now
see two flowers we have completed now next to connect this petal of this second flower with the petal of this first flower we have to directly connect we can directly connect this with uh, single triple crochet triple crochet to connect one and two wrappings are required for triple crochet and two from the first circle again triple crochet again Okay, so now here we'll skip the last petal of this first flower and now we are going to make second flower row. So for that we just skip here our last petal of this first flower that we will complete at the end. So chain 9. So chain nine, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Now make a circle of first five chains one, two, three, four, five with slip stitch. Just insert hook in fifth chain and make a circle chain four one two three and four and just connect these four chains with the previous first chain or with this with the end of this petal just insert hook here and just connect this the slip stitch now now change the position of your thread now three times now two times triple crochet from the same circle Total 5 stitches are completed for first petal. Now the position is like this. Now in the next phase 
we are going to we are going to stitch nine chains and make second circle so chain nine a circle of first five chains one two three four five with slip stitch again chain four two three and four and connect this four chains with the previous pattern with a slip stitch okay so now turn now our thread is here just shift this work over here and times triple crochet make this circle properly Oh, sorry, just remove this work. Now, uh, from this four chain, we have to connect this chain from here. Yes, because we are going to make pattern like this so just connect this chain from here ok now it is correct triple crochet to again one more time triple crochet Again, one more time triple crochet okay so now this is perfect now just connect this pattern with this second pattern of first flower row from this position from this position with slip stitch ok so now again we are going to make next pattern total one two three and four okay at the fourth stitch we need to connect this pattern with this flower flower pattern okay now chain four one two three and four and with slip stitch we 
now for the next petal of this flower now again we are going to use chain 4 and we'll connect the petal of this flower with this petal so chain 4 1 2 3 and 4 now again we are going to connect this petal with the starting point of this petal at here with a slip stitch okay now double triple crochet again triple crochet again triple crochet Again one more triple crochet. Okay, so at this point we have finished our work of second flower with two pattern. Now for the next phase we are going to make third flower of this second row so for that we need to chain nine times again make circle and start working with petals so chain nine one two three four five six seven eight and nine make a circle with first five chains one two three four five With slip stitch chain 4 1 2 3 and 4 just connect this chain the previous end of this flower now triple crochet for two times okay so total four stitches are ready so now we are going to connect the previous pattern of previous flower row at this point just slip stitch and chain four one two three and four and just connect with this circle with single stitch again chain four one two three and four and connect with the with this petal from this with single stitch and now work three times triple crochet two and the last one so Okay, so now next we are going to make a third flower of this 
third petal of this flower so for that chain four one two and three just finish this petal with single crochet chain four two three and four four times triple crochet One, two, three, and four again. One more. Okay. Uh, now chain stitch four times. Single crochet. Four chains. Four times triple crochet. One, two, three, and four. So now see how it looks. Now, first flower we have completed. Of this second flower row now we are going to connect this petal of this first flower directly with the help of triple crochet with the petal of this second flower so just triple crochet and insert hook into the next flower of the circle triple crochet three times more again three times more again again one more time one two three four okay so for the fifth line we are going to use single crochet four times end it with single crochet sorry four chains and we have ended this four chains with single crochet again four chains four times triple crochet So total five lines are ready one two three four five and now we are going to connect okay so now we are going to connect so now we are going to connect this petal with the petal of this flower with three times with uh, triple crochet from this circle triple crochet again one more time triple crochet from the same circle okay now just complete this pattern with four times chain stitch and single crochet now again chain four triple crochet for three times two one two
सो थ्री टाइम्स ट्रिपल क्रोशे वी आर कंप्लीटेड नाउ जस्ट फिनिश दिस विथ फोर टाइम्स चेन स्टिच एंड विथ सिंगल क्रोशे नाउ वॉट वी डीड अप टू नाउ इज just work okay so now two petals are remaining just to complete this flower stitch so next we are going to make this petal and this petal will be connected with this flower petal so chain 4 1 2 3 and 4 then four times triple crochet from this flower from this circle one two three and four now it is now this petal will be connected with this petal with triple crochet triple crochet four times one two three one more and four now chain four to complete the stitch four and single crochet from the circle so here finally we have completed our work so from the whole process of making this stitch we have started with the petals making from here that is our starting point we we have first created this petal then this next this one with the circle then this 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 then we have started reverse process then we have created this two petals then we have connected this two petals with this two and with this one then we have skipped here just revised we have skipped here and we have connected this petal with this one and with making of this circle then in this direction we have created this two petals then this two and further we have connected all these patterns so similarly if you want to go if you want to make more than this two flower rows then for that just skip process here then start here and again skip here then chain 9 times 9 times connected with this point and make your number of rows and at the end when you finished your last row then connect in the down direction thank you